Hello fellow crafters and welcome back to Max DM Crafting. This is uh, like a new kind of stuff for this channel. I was very inspired by the Nerd Forge and I want to try something like uh, I never tried before, book binding. But uh, before you know change the channel, before giving up on this video, please stay tuned because this is a book binding totally related to tabletop game because I'm gonna craft this. Uh, no, not this one. This. Uh, no, this one neither. But uh, look at that. This is my Loretum. Was uh, my book of adventure, the quest book that I craft when I was 11, guys. So, hmm, quite old right now, sadly. I was thinking to try something totally new for my Hero Quest Resurrection series. So I was thinking, why not this? And uh, I was totally inspired by Sherbaghera, that is actually Martina from the Nerd Forge, Nerd Forge. And uh, they just reached 1 million subscribers, guys. 1 million, okay? I cannot count to 1 million, so yeah. But uh, she's doing a great and amazing job on book binding. And uh, on this channel, guys, uh, I'm not doing that kind of stuff. But for Hero Quest, having a book with all the quests together would be amazing, would be epic, would be great, guys. So I won't try that. But sadly, I'm a poor guy. So basically, I want to try to create a book to do some book binding with what I have in my house. Not fancy stuff, just the cheap way, guys. Just the easy way. First of all, all the quests. For do that, I want to say thanks once again to Nerd Forge for the great inspiration, but most of all to the Ye Olde Inn, that is actually the, uh, this one, you see the logo, is the real source of, uh, you know, printable inspiration for all the HeroQuest lovers, guys. So give a shot to that site, you can download everything you can see uh, about HeroQuest is there, okay? So just go to Ye Olde Inn and uh, check it out, guys. It's amazing if you are interested in this all amazing, fascinating game, okay? First of all, let's go print all the, you know, booklets, all the um, quest books, all the expansions books, because I need to have uh, all the paper together for create the content of this Loreton. Crack on!
the difficult part, maybe one of the difficult part. I want to create, you know, the uh, book binder that is actually a structure that is uh, like a frame for a uh, fix, you know, and so the, uh, the part, the issues of the book. For do that, Martina of Nerforge used some uh, fancy uh, stuff. I think she built something with the wood, but uh, since I need a frame, why not use a frame? I will use this one, so basically with this we can uh, have uh, a frame and uh, all the rest is basically very self-explaining, so let's book binding! Okay, now we have the structure, but uh, um, it's not very stable, so with the books I hope I can work. Now is the worst part. I hate sewing, guys, using the needle and stuff like that, but uh, this is the best occasion, the best chance for improve on that. So a new video, a new skill, let's sewing and uh, let's go!
the covers are a very delicate part and uh, for do that I'm using the graphics medium chipboard. Uh, please notice that I'm using always the same jig, always the same template for having the perfect alignment of, you know, the holes and the, you know, the ropes and all of that things. Notice please that all the glue that I'm using here, this white PVA glue, is not just PVA normal glue, is wood glue because uh, I need something that is very, very strong and uh, dries very fast. So all the glue that you are seeing in this video is wood glue. I have just some green ribbon, so I will use it for uh, make a bookmark. And uh, yeah, maybe the color is not perfect, but this is like an experiment. So let's see what we can do, okay? Let's go. The books work perfectly and uh, basically we have a pressed perfect volume now guys. So it's time for cover it with some fake leather. Yeah, Martina by Nerd Forge is using, uh, she's using a fancy beautiful uh, yeah, particular and epic leather. I don't have it so I'm just using some, you know, uh, adhesive, adhesive uh, leather. This kind of, the, actually a couple of sheets cost few euros so i have some of that in my in my house so let's cover uh, the you know the volume with that for the final part for the final decoration i'm gonna use some uh, foam sheets uh, they are you know these rubber foam sheets they are very simple to carve and cut so they are perfect for the particular decoration that i need on the lower tone okay at the end of that we are gonna finish the project with some uh, amazing uh, music and uh, pictures before go to the end i want to say thanks thank you thank you to my patrons because all these videos are possible just because you are sponsoring them so please continue to support the channel if you are new here please visit the channel we have a lot of new and cool stuff on everything about tabletop gaming and do it yourself stuff so it's quite an interesting channel Okay, so check it out and if you want to support me because the best way to yeah to permit to allow me to continue these videos is that you support me through Patreon 
or PayPal. You can find the links in the description box below. Also, if you would like some of the materials that I'm using in all my videos, check the Amazon links in the description box. You will find everything you need for craft as an animal, craft as an Italian animal, craft as me. <laughs> okay, now let's go for the final shots and uh, see you at the end, okay? Crack on! Okay guys, pros and cons. I'm very, very pleased, I'm very satisfied with this uh, book, guys. Uh, the, the, the best thing is that, uh, you know, just a few days ago I don't have nothing and now I have this in my hand and I build it with my hand. This is great, this is great. Uh, cons, okay, next time for sure I will use some different color and also we have some issues I, I put some uh, paper tape here for you see for the cover because I miss some uh, additional um, you know pages for the introduction and the end of the book uh, I was just following by memory the nerd forge videos guys but if you are interested in something like that <laughs> take a look at that channel this is this is nothing in compare to what uh, Martina is doing there, okay? But uh, thanks again to Nerd4, thanks to Martina for the inspiration, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Till next time, the, the fire, fire burns warmly, but casts a little light into Mentos Tiny. Happy crafting! crafting.